Yo, what is up, you guys? So we are joined by Ander Baranetchel. I probably did not pronounce it right. If you know how to pronounce it, let me know in the comments. Because um, he looks like a decent card. So he plays with Real Fothiadad, um, oddly in the same position as Oyozabo. And his name is just as hard to pronounce as Oyozabo. Um, let's let's have a look at the card. Four star, four star, five nine, medium, medium. Doesn't look too bad from this angle. Pace good. Um, ninety six, ninety three, good split there. Shooting looks pretty good to me. Penalties are at the lowest stat, which is completely fine on a winger. Um, the attack position is super high. Finishing super high. Um, shot power is very important on the wings when you want to blast in those shots near post. Very good. Um, passing. Free kick accuracy is very low, which isn't uh, a problem. Long passing, though, is a problem. The curve, especially for a winger, is a bit of a problem. So the passing could use some help. Dribbling-wise, 91 balance, 89 agility. That seems fine, especially for a player who's 5'9". That, that's completely fine. Reactions and composure are very low, you have to admit. Those are very low, dangerously low. Um, physicals. 99 jumping, 92 stamina, 90, 76 strength. That's very good for a 5'9". That's actually sublime for a 5'9 player. I'll show you the full stats here. Um, decent heading actually as well, man. All round, a pretty decent looking card. The dribbling's 90 as well. 85 ball control. Very good stats. Um, obviously, the issues with this card is the long passing and curve. As well as the reactions and composure. Now, if you use an engine chem style, which I would recommend... Um, it does solve a lot of the problems, or at least most of them. So with an engine chem style, this card can be very, very good. Very, very good. Now, let's have a look at, first of all, what is the moment for? Uh, under 23 team season moments under Berent next year. Celebrating superb inside the box goal against Ibar. Okay. How much is it worth? 84 and 85. Whew. 84 and 85. Hmm. Is that worth it? I genuinely think that's very good value. Especially when you get two packs back as well. Which aren't the best packs given. But this is worth it in my opinion. I have to admit. Um, you can re really easily get these squads just from building upgrades. Team season objectives that you will never use. Uh, for example, Sosa, you can easily get this card done. And if it's a starting 11 player for you, um, or even a bench player, this can be very good. Now, I will say that you could also just go out and get Neymar, and he'll be just as good. So, unless you specifically need a Spanish winger, left winger, just go get Neymar instead. Unless you specifically need a Spanish winger. In that case, go for it. That's all I can say. Um, let me know what you guys think about this under Berenextio SBC. Let me know how to pronounce it. Drop a like, drop a sub. See you guys in a bit. Peace.